Hello everyone, welcome to this video lesson. In this video lesson, we would like to derive an equation for the energy density of a capacitor. First of all, what do you mean by energy density? Energy density is simply the energy there in the capacitor per unit volume. Means how much energy is packed for the given volume is nothing but energy density. We have already derived for the energy of a capacitor as energy stored in a capacitor as half cv square by volume. That's simply energy density. So we can rewrite it as half cv square by volume as area into area of cross section of any of the capacitor into distance between the plates. Anyway, we have already derived an equation for capacity of a capacitor is epsilon naught a by d and potential square by volume area into d so area and area can be cancelled so we can express energy density as half epsilon naught potential difference between the plates square by distance square but we know the relation as electric of field intensity E equal to dV by dr by differentiating we can get it as something like V by r or something like V by d where r or d is the distance that implies in the place of V by d I can write electric field strength or electric field intensity that implies we can write further energy density in that capacitor is energy per unit volume is half epsilon naught potential by distance whole square so energy per volume can be rewritten as half epsilon naught in the place of potential by distance between the plates electric intensity square this is how we can write the equation and we can solve the problems if somebody is looking for finding out energy density of a capacitor that means how much energy is packed between the plates of a capacitor simply depends on the electric intensity that is there between the plates the electric intensity obviously depends on the applied potential by distance so if you want to pack more energy per unit volume either you have to apply more potential or you have to apply less distance between the plates of capacitor applying more potential doesn't make sense because capacitor means we want to store more energy at a lesser possible potential or with a lesser energy therefore with less distance between the plates with less distance between the plates we can store more energy per volume in the capacitor that's how we have to design our capacitor to get the best out of it. Thank you for watching. Keep coming back for more and more video lessons.